I just want to curl up in a ball and snuggle with you. Hey, no, then why are you leaving? If you want to snuggle with me, then don't run away. Hello, everybody. Uh, this is Nathan here, and, uh, oh, God. Ugh, I, I promise my teeth are not horribly yellow. Uh, that is just the way that the lighting is reflecting off them, I guess. I have a, I have, like, this nice, cute little orange tinted light, and the way that it is reflecting off of my teeth makes them look frankly disgusting um anyways hello my name is nathan and today we are going to be playing drifting hearts which is a game that i have been pretty excited about playing for some time although admittedly i'm a little bit fuzzy on what exactly it is my understanding it is a street racing game meets a dating simulator meets Animal Crossing? I might be entirely wrong. That is just what I gathered at a glance from a brief read-through of the description. Either way, I am hooked. Like, before even touching it, I am in. So with that in mind, uh... I guess, really, let's just get started and let's see what this game is all about. I don't know what I'm doing. How do I go? Oh, shit. No, they're leaving me behind! Ah! No! Alright. Oh, wait, what? Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. What was I doing? Hold on. Okay. Oh, hello, my dear. Don't take me for grunt. Wait, no, come back. Come back, friend. I would love to give you hogs and kisses. That's kind of adorable. No, get back! Get back! I'm really good at piggybacking. Is this just shitty puns in a racing game? And you advance them if you drive close to the other driver? That's goofy i'm gonna i'm gonna go on ahead I'm not really feeling the whole i'm not i'm not feeling the swine dude hey, are you the sun because you're brighter than my future i got him stuck can't escape my love i can't escape either oh shit hello i'm back i'd like to go on a vacation with you oh shit get back here Maybe Tuscany? Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. Whoever did this, you should feel ashamed. Oh my god, I love this. <laughs> no! No, I need you. I'm quite piggy when it comes to choosing. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, that's the worst. What happens if I get all this? Let me- No, love me! LOVE ME! My bristles are really soft. If you behave, you may touch them. Ooh! Come on, max them out! Let's roll in the mud together after- That sounds suggestive. I just might. Did I- Did I do it? All right, so I maxed him out. Now let's just see what happens when we win the race. Like, are, are there events, or is it just like the one race and some shitty puns, which, as much as I complain about them, shitty puns are the best. Not gonna lie, kinda into the frog girl. I'm, I'm here for that. All right, just two more laps. We're on six of seven, so we have to complete lap six and seven. So yeah, two more laps. Let me get to see what the fuck happens when this is over. Like, is this just a one... Is this just a one-and-done thing? 
That's not great. Apparently we can just drive through the lake and it's just fine. M makes me wonder if we can take some bullshit shortcuts, but let's just, uh... Ooh, hold on, wait a minute. N no, no, I'm staying loyal to the hog man for now. I think it's a hog, the, the dude with the tusks. It was a hog. Yeah. Okay. So what happens now? Oh, nothing. I... I'm slightly disappointed by that. I'm gonna be totally honest. I, I, I wanted there to be a little something more to this. I don't know what else there could have been. So I'm just gonna hear some more shitty puns. Fucking love me! Looking sharp today. Wait, was that orange or was that yellow? I think that was you. Hell yeah, I was. Get back here. Get back here right now. Ah. I give the best hedge hug. <laughs> Come on. I might not be as fast as my brother, but nice guys finish last. My brother always used to say, gotta come last, or something like them. I... I'm very taken aback by that, because that was simultaneously a sonic joke and a sexual innuendo. And I'm here for that, too. Fuck it. Do you enjoy acupuncture? I definitely do. I want you to just fucking impale me with your spines. Come on. That's the ticket. I just want to curl up in a ball and snuggle with you. Hey, no, then why are you leaving? If you want to snuggle with me, then don't run away. That is the opposite of how to do that. How do hedgehogs make love? Very, very care. Okay. Okay. I see you. Message received. I will be back for you. I am not a furry. Did I leave everyone else behind? Wait, no, I saw someone. I, I don't know why I was peeking around like I could see around the trees that way. Sorry. Who are you? No. You had your turn. What about you? No, come back. Ah! Oh, you're looking at my fur. Oh, I don't like you very much. That was... I don't know what it is. Just something about your design makes you seem slimy. Not like physically slimy, but emotionally slimy. Hmm. But who are you? Looking cool, Blue. Oh, hello, my dear. Hello to you, too. You're quite beautiful if I say do my... Say do, huh? Gonna be honest? That one didn't do it for me. Let's see what else you got. Oh, fuck! No! No! No, come back! Oh, I got you now. Your eyes are bluer than the ocean, and I- And you what? And you what? And I don't mind being lost at sea. Oh, ho <laughs> ho you smooth talking son of a bitch. The deer is not the only one. Orny. I'm sorry. That's a little on the nose. Ha ha ha!
Oh god. Oh god, wait. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, okay, we're safe, we're good, we're out. Don't worry about bad weather, I'm not a reindeer. Come on. Are you an impatient driver? Because you give me the horn. Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, no, what was the last thing? You are so dear to- oh, you- that's how you end it? Oh, fuck you, no. That was great, and you just had to ruin it at the end. I'm pretty sure that was the same type of pun you made the first time. You can't make two puns with the word deer. Oh no. This is dumb. This is dumb and I mean that in the best way. I. That's it. That's it for me. That's it for me. Alright. Thoughts on the game. First and foremost, uh, what I immediately want to talk about is the fact that a merging of genres such as a racing game and a dating simulator is a bold choice uh like i said right off the bat i am here for that that is new that is creative and honestly, that's just the kind of nonsense shenanigans that I'm here for. I do have some critiques of the game, but we will get to that in just a moment. I think that the art was very nice looking for what it was. The character designs were very cute. The dialogue was, you know, it, it, it was just a bunch of shitty puns. But again, that's not, that's not a bad thing um I, I know because i call them shitty that sounds like i am making some kind of complaint i'm not i would never be dissatisfied with a bad pun so having a game completely built around them is pretty great one thing i will say and keep in mind this was a small indie game. I have no idea regarding the circumstances of its development. I don't know if it was designed for like a game jam. I don't know how much time was put into it or how little time could have been put into it. So this isn't really speaking in regards to that. This is more so just me saying what I would have personally liked that would have made it more enjoyable to me. I think that there wasn't enough content there for it to be a fully realized, fully enjoyable game. The gimmick of it worked well, I am glad that I played it, but I will never play it again. And the reason for that is it's just one race, a series of puns, and that's the end of it and again that is great for the joke that is great for the gimmick and it lands it really does but what i think would have made it better would have been for something to come of it some kind of event some kind of characterization beyond the puns you know if you're gonna make a dating sim racing game you gotta kind of focus on the dating sim element a little bit to really sell that aspect of it. But again, I don't think overall that was the full intention. I think they were making a goofy shenanigans little game. And I think they succeeded in that. That it, it was truly hilarious to play. Uh, that being said, I would be so excited if they announced some kind of update, expansion, um, some kind of additional content towards the game, or some kind of a sequel. Pretty much anything that could take the existing foundation that they have and really build a fully fleshed out game. 
on top of it. Because what they had set up there is really cool. I will say, some of those puns that J. Doe made about giving him the horn, for example, bold choice, not what I was expecting. And I think that that collision between the cutesy art style and the blatant sexuality of some of the comments they made was part of what made the joke land as well as it did. But the audacity, the audacity that you have to design a game where such cute characters are going to be putting the moves on you and you can't do anything about it. Mm. But in short, not to keep hammering on the same point, because there's really only so much that you can say about a game like this. Uh, great game. Had a lot of fun with it. There are some things I would improve, but it, it worked really well for what it was, and I'm glad that I played it. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to like, leave a comment to subscribe if there is anything that i missed in this game or anything extra that you'd like me to see please do let me know and i i will go back and revisit it if there is other content worth seeing i, I might just be dumb and have missed it if there are any other games in a similar vein or just games in general you think i would be interested in or you'd like to see me play on the channel just let me know in the comments below thank you all very much for watching and i will see you next time.